you know her that VLM is fast, but on your local machine, why doesn't it feel that way? The secret of VLM is ability to save recomputed results. For example, if you see a prompt the second time, you can reuse this pre-computed results. The VLM can save this pre-computed result as KV cache and reuse it during the second time. So what is stopping you from achieving that speed? Achieving that speed, the bottleneck is the GPU memory, which usually has 24 gigs that doesn't have enough space to store all these uh, tokens. However, now how to solve it? We can use LM. Now enters LM cache, which allows you to expand the memory from GPU to the host memory it's about 100 to 200 gigabytes. Expand your memory size from GPU to the entire host memory, which consists of 100 gig or even 254 gig. What will be the results? In the first, you can achieve 13 times speed up with that simple trick. How to do it? First, let's deploy some, uh, let's install VLM. First, let's go to Dynamo. Clone the code in our Visual Studio code. Let's get clone CD into Dynamo and then spin up the networking components. How to install VLM? Use the container build command and then we can run the container and launch straight right in. Inside this VLM container, you install the NVShim package, spin up a front end, and launch the back end with LM cache enabled and a CPU. We can set it to 64 gigabytes depending on your CPU RAM size. The model we are using is Queen 3. Send a prompt to it. What is the capital of US? enter we received a response that i know the capital of the us is somewhere so this now we can query it uh, with this endpoint however we want but how look that it was really fast but how fast what is it actually is let us go to the first terminal uh, stop the process using wget this url to install, to download the CPU offloading benchmarking script. And let's try Python, this script, and enable LM cache to see how much improvement will it bring. The result, the first run without LM cache consumes nine seconds. But the second run with the KV cache, it only takes 0.7 seconds and the speed up is 13.14%. It's not a small improvement, right? How can you get started? Follow the link in the description and try out the commands. If you want to learn more about KV cache, check out the NVIDIA blog on what KV cache is and how it is used with LM cached. See more examples at the LM cache website. Thank you for watching.